I recently retreated to Texas, just outside Dallas, where my parents own these two beautiful properties. And we are just staying in this community and really enjoying ourselves. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm excited to share highlights from our trip to Dallas. We're staying with my parents during this quarantine time, we decided that we needed to break away and get a change of scenery. And here we are at this beautiful lake near my parents' estate. We're about to go fishing. So it promises to be a real adventure. I used to fish when I was younger. We also lived on a lake when I was younger. So I'm gonna see if I can, you know, shake the rust off my fishing skills and help these kids catch a fish today. Actually, the last time I even held a fishing rod was several years ago at a place called Victory Ranch in Utah, which is outside of Park City. It's a beautiful place. You should look into it if you love backcountry and outdoor activities. I'm actually kind of a country girl deep down in heart. The last time we went fishing was actually fly fishing on that couple's getaway, and I was not the hero of the day. Kofi actually was when it came to the fishing. All right, you guys ready to go fishing? Yeah. Ready to do this? It is beautiful. Such a peaceful and serene setting. It promises to be a really nice, fun, and relaxing afternoon. And I really hope that we're able to catch at least something. The last time the kids came out here with my parents for the summer, all they caught was a turtle. <laughs> There's the turtle. So dad, do you have experience fishing? Well, other than my experience with my kids and grandkids, beyond that, I don't have any special. <laughs> 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 I don't have any special fishing experience, but I have a little bit of crabbing experience. Crabbing experience. Okay, so we're gonna see how that crabbing experience can translate into <laughs> into, into fishing experience today. <laughs> So tell me what you're doing now. I'm gonna get the worm and put it on my hook. Okay, let's see it. Okay, you got the worm. Wait. Pick him up. You might want to put the container down when you're done. Set it down gently. All right, and then here's the hook. You gotta hook him in there. Wait, is he gonna die? <laughs> he won't be totally dead. Oh, I got it through, I got it through. You got it through? Let's see, let's see it. Again, there we go. You, oh. <laughs> All right, you got him on there. I think he's just he's barely on there, Lincoln. I think you have put it through all the way through his body. Working hard already, right? There you go. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, he got it. You he lost it. it. He, he took, took the worm. That's good. Because then when he bites, he's gonna have to bite through there, right? Yeah, he's gonna have to bite and then his thing's gonna get through. Things gonna get stuck here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, I think so. This is his mouth. Okay, watch out before you knock over all the worms. It's, it's <laughs> like it's like the turtle. It's like the turtle. It got caught like, like this, worms or worms? This is an adventure. It's like an okay. ice collar. You just have to get the worm out and I'll put it on. Oh, 
I don't think there's any more left. No, there, there's there's like 30 worms in there. Uh, oh, I see one. All right. Ew. See. Oh, I see one right there. Oh, no. Yeah, just grab them. Just oh, grab them. No. Just don't think oh, about it. Oh, no. Yeah. Just take a deep breath. And then you just gotta go. Oh, it almost going backwards. Okay. You got this. You got this. I don't even see it anywhere. Oh, too bad. It's gone. I made it. There, there he goes. No. There he goes. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> Where's you're, that listen, pink plastic cutting, bait? Where's you're, the get, you're cutting <laughs> into your own fishing time right now. You got this. You got this. There's money in there. Okay, don't don't shake them all out. No. You got them? You got them? No, I don't have them. I don't. No. <laughs> I want to look at it, but then I can't pick it up without, without looking. You gotta look. It's just a little thing. Just think of it as a. It's just a I thing. I hate insects. I don't even. It's think not really an insect. insect. But no, I hate it's like these a. Kind of things. Can you do it? You got him. Great. All right. Fish of the okay, day, folks. <laughs> all right. Oh my goodness. What are you gonna name him? Todd, there he is, folks. Todd. Todd, right there. Nice job, Maya. I should actually even name him Potato. Potato, you know, you did a good job. Oh! I got the first fish in the day! Oh my god, you caught yourself. Look at the water in the bucket. Here, just hurry up. I'm gonna drop the bucket. Stop watching! Okay, wait a minute. What is his name? What are you gonna name him? We got him. What are you gonna name him? <laughs> what are you gonna name him? We got him. We got you gonna name him. We got him. <laughs> <laughs> look, got me when you look at. Oh, got him. Got him. She got another got one. Him. Wait a minute. Got what, him. what are you gonna name him? Mimi. Mini me. Yeah, I guess we're gonna name him. What are you gonna name him? I don't know. I might name him Todd. If you know, another one. I like that name, Todd. Oh, Frank. Is that why I used it? Frank. Name Frank. him Frank. <laughs> this is Frank. Mimi caught hers. Ooh, yeah. that's a good so, choice. since we lost our hook to one of the fish, we have to assemble the line again. So, this is the technique. You wrap it around several times. I think about seven times, something like that. And then you put it through the loop that's close to it. And then you also want to put it through the big loop that you create. Try not to get hooked. And then you're going to pull this, slide it in tight. Good tight knot on your hook. Thank you. All right, I need All to. Right, I need we don't have scissors out here. So I need to see if I can cut the line somehow. I don't know what I'm gonna do. We might not be able to cut it because. Wait, but isn't it a matter? I have this line. It doesn't matter too much. It's just a little. Somebody's gonna have to get your worm. We still aren't over this worm stuff. No, I caught the fish and almost dislocated my finger. That was ridiculous. Right, yeah. Let's see if I can get you a worm. Right. <laughs> oh, I do. I do. Did I start to get it? No, it was like I was so happy because I finally got it far out and it was Whoa. right next to me. Whoa, look. Leave it there, leave it there so you can Now watch your bobbin. Can you me Because if you build them, you got something to do. Yeah. Not the big one. <laughs> I'm going to try to get it like a little farther out. Yeah, the turtles are all over now. Yeah. yeah they're like here, here, Look at this. Look at them trying to get there. Oh, 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 o
Do I have something on oh, my there, line? Look, 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 look. You see something's eating it? Yeah. Is that a root of water? No, yeah, I think I make sure I don't have, I still have the thing on there. Oh, they ate my thing. <laughs> they ate my worm, they ate my worm, y'all. They ate my worm. <laughs> it's good for you to be able to touch the worm because you never know. If you work in a lab. I'm not going to work in a lab. <laughs> <laughs> Well then, listen, let me cut me off, then let me stop talking. <laughs>